What is up my fellow techies? Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. You know what? Happy Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa. That should cover everybody. And with those words, you know what that means. CES 2025 is here. The Super Bowl for us tech nerds. The chance to see what new tech and gadgets await us in the months and years to come. Some we can't afford, some that we'll never see a light of day. But hey, it's great to see what is out there. Now, every year I take a look at what the major players are expected to showcase at CES. And if you wanna stay up to date with what CES has in store, then you've landed at the right place. Do me a huge favor, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and hit that like button if you enjoy this type of content. All right, let's jump into this. Gamers and tech enthusiasts, it's that magical time of the year again. CES. And if the whispers are to be true, Nvidia is about to drop some absolute bombshells. Nvidia CEO Jensen Huang is expected to kick off CES with a keynote address that's likely to feature more than just GPUs. Rumors suggest Nvidia might also unveil next gen CPUs and updates to their AI powered software. Get ready, the desktop and mobile versions of the RTX 50 series could make your rig more powerful than ever. Just remember to pack a fire extinguisher because the laptops are going to be packing some heat. First up, let's talk GPUs. Rumor has it, Nvidia will be introducing the RTX 5000 series. Now, if you're thinking it's just another number increase, think again. These beasts are rumored to pack some serious power, potentially offering 70% performance boost over their predecessors. Yep, the RTX 5090 is already making waves with rumors of performance that'll leave your 4090 in the dust, if you can imagine that. That's like upgrading from a regular cup of coffee to a triple espresso for your gaming setup. Now, let's talk specs. According to the grapevine, a certain over-enthusiastic Zotac website, here's what we're looking at. The RTX 5090 with 32 gigabytes of GDDR7 RAM, the RTX 5080 with 16 gigabytes of GDDR7 RAM, that's just to name a couple. That's GDDR7 memory, people, not the GDDR6, which is practically ancient at this point. DDR7 promises data access speeds up to 60% faster and a 20% reduction in power consumption. So yes, the GPUs are powerful and eco-friendly as well. So what does all this mean for us mere mortals? Well, if the leaks are accurate, the RTX 5090 and its siblings could redefine what's possible in gaming, AI, and even content generation. But let's be real. These cards aren't going to be cheap. Early adopters, prepare your wallets. Everybody else, start saving for the RTX 5060. But there's even more for the gamers. Nvidia should introduce DLSS 4 with the RTX 5000 series. Now, if you love DLSS 3, well, this could be like going from a bicycle to a rocket powered e-bike for your gaming performance. More FPS, better graphics, and less power consumption, they might even introduce something called neural rendering. No, it's not about neural networks painting your graphics, but it's close. Think AI enhancing your visuals in ways which you've only dreamed about in your shader dreams. Sign me up. As excited as we may get about gaming and graphics and the mere possibilities of what the RTX 5000 series card could achieve, AI is Nvidia's bread and butter. Expect some jaw-dropping AI tech announcements. They've been teasing us with hints about AI capabilities that could revolutionize not just gaming, but how we interact with the technology. We're talking about potential leaps in generative AI, making your virtual assistants smarter than ever, or even new ways AI can assist us in creating content on the fly. But, Let's keep it real. With all this AI talk, I'm half expecting Nvidia to reveal a GPU that can make its own coffee. Hey GPU, how about a latte? And boom, your PC starts streaming milk. That's a dream, right? 
Moving on to the automotive world, NVIDIA has been pushing into this space with their InDrive platform. CES 2025 could see some updates here. Perhaps new partnerships or tech that will make your car feel like it's starting in its own sci-fi movie. Think about vehicles that not only drive themselves, but also entertain you with AI curated playlists. So what's the takeaway for NVIDIA at CES 2025? It could redefine what we expect from our tech, from gaming to driving to how we use AI. It's not just about more power, it's about smarter power. Whether you're a tech nerd or just love good gadgets, this is gonna be one of those moments where you want to say, I was there when Nvidia changed the game. So get into that comment section and let me know what you wanna see from Nvidia at CES this year. Once again, thank you for taking the time out to watch this video. If you're new to this channel, and want to stay up to date with the latest CES news, then this is the spot for you. Make sure you do me a huge favor. Hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and if you enjoy this type of content, hit that like button as well. Now, if you have friends or family that want to stay up to date with the latest CES news, make sure you share that with them as well. And for even more tech news in video form, check out one of these videos right here. And until the next video, guys, stay nerdy.